648 and now it's time for another new edition of Taste of the Town. This time an iconic motel in the Mimo district gets a whole new look and vibe. It also has a new sushi restaurant feature and unique dishes created by a well-known Japanese chef. CBS 4's Lisa Petrillo takes you to Vagabond Sushi Bar and Market inside the all-new Vagabond Village. Welcome to Vagabond Sushi Bar and Market inside what's now called Vagabond Village at the Mimo District's historic Vagabond Hotel. The property also features a lush tropical vibe at the Oasis Pool and a bar and private pool room. There's also a market with Asian style essentials. It's all open to the public and all the brainchild of restaurateur Amir Ben Zion. The Mimo District runs roughly from 50th Street to 77th Street along Biscayne Boulevard. Starting all the way downtown, going all the way to North Miami Avenue. I believe this is the home of the local successful working, building, creators of Miami. Not in Wynwood, not in Midtown, not on South Beach, it's the Mimo District. Exactly. Very cool. This is Miami. Ben Zion fully renovated the restaurant using his personal artwork. The design is eclectic. The colors on the walls were inspired by a painting that hangs on the wall made by local artist Juan Rosas. The muted tone, the distressed effect. Uh, the blend of darker, still warmer, romantic, meaningful colors that can work together only when they're together. Vagabond Sushi Bar ships sushi direct from Japan, expertly sliced and prepared by executive chef Mike Hiraga, formerly of Bond Street and Blue Ribbon Sushi. It's amazing to do sushi with a Japanese hardcore chef. Okay, so all of our food comes from the market in Tokyo. We get a lot of specials, we get a lot of very interesting items that you can get locally anyway. We'll start with the Vagabond Sashimi Deluxe Sharing Plate, which has tuna, salmon, hamachi, and more. I'm told to just quickly pop the tuna into the soy sauce and wasabi. It's really delicious, and by the way, that was a great way to do it, just a, just a pop. Yeah, just a pop. Next, the wild salmon. Clean and fresh. And then it, it has the skin on it that gives it something, I don't know, the fattiness is released. Then the Japanese snapper salad with ume dressing. It's just mm -hmm. chunks of snapper. Okay. Uh, too. With that beautiful ginger jelly. The vinaigrette dressing that I would not know to put with that really brings it to another level of, it, it gives it a salad feel, but then with the fresh fish. We end on the classic and delicious rainbow inside out roll. Vagabond Sushi Bar at Vagabond Village, an eclectic spot that's a feast for the eyes as well as the palate. Well, Amir, I've got a lot more eating to do, but let's tell everybody how many days we're open here at Vagabond Sushi. Uh, we're open seven days a week, and we open at 6 p.m. every day. For dinner. For dinner. What do we say in Japanese? Brunch is coming soon. Kampai. Kampai. Or we can always say Lachaim. Lachaim as well. With a wonderful taste of the town in the Mimo District, I'm Lisa Petrillo, CBS 4 News. Woo.